Do you see yourself the way God sees you? God sees you nothing without Christ. But the other side of that same coin is that God sees you everything with Christ. Christ makes all the difference. If you want to know what you look like spiritually, you need to look into the mirror of God's word. God sees you as acceptable. He made us accepted in the beloved. Acceptance is a gift. The opposite of acceptance is rejection. But the opposite of rejection is being chosen. He chose us in Christ before the creation of the world to be holy and blameless in his sight. You have been chosen by God himself. No matter how you see yourself, God sees you as acceptable because of Jesus. He sees you as lovable. The Lord declares that you are precious and honored in my sight. I have loved you with an everlasting love. Ang love ng Dios ay consistent, unconditional. There's no strings attached. His love is not based on conditions. It's based on His character. God is love. It's not just something He does. It's who He is. God's love never fails. It's everlasting. Nothing will ever separate you from the love of God. And when you don't believe that you're loved, it causes you to behave as one who is unloved. You might not feel lovable. You might not act lovable, but God still sees you worthy of his love. And if you believe that, it will keep you out of sin. God sees you as forgivable. God chooses not to see you as a sinner. Sin is not a hindrance for God to love and accept and forgive you. God has a solution for sin, and it's through what happened to Jesus on the cross. In Christ, God chooses to see you as one who is perfectly forever forgiven. God sees you as capable. That's the grace of God, the power of God flowing into you to enable you and make you capable of doing whatever he wants you to do, to become whoever he wants you to be. Just seek first his kingdom. I can do all things through Christ who gives me strength, who gives me the grace. Whatever it is that God deposited into your life, God will equip you and make you capable of doing it. Don't see yourself as a failure. You gotta see yourself as capable. You are capable to do whatever he's called you to do. Two things that will enhance the capability that God gives to you. God's word in your heart, that is real food. It's the scriptures that will make us capable to have all that we need to do every good work. And the next thing you need is God's presence in your life. You've got to get into the presence of God frequently. If you feel like you're being deceived and you're not seeing yourself clearly, get the word of God, get into God's presence. The word of God in your heart, presence of God in your life. Put on the lenses of God's grace and you'll begin to see what God sees, that you are acceptable, lovable, forgivable and that you are capable. All of these things only because of Jesus Christ.